What's up, Blade fam? Today we are gonna be hosting my homie, Dave Hill. We're just pulling up to the Marriott. Let's go get this guy. There he is. What's up, man? What's up? <laughs> How you doing, brother? Good. Great. Oh, yeah. Have a good night. Yes, I did. Yeah. A quick introduction. This is the homie Dave Hill from Seattle. You want to say anything? Spokane. Yes, Spokane, Seattle. Washington. Washington. I know he was from somewhere over there. <laughs> <laughs> so what are we going to do today? We're going to go roll. We're going to go roll. Start off with a sushi roll though, because we're hungry. So we just got here to Tokyo Joe's, chilling. We're going to wait, so I'm going to ask this man some questions and uh, get to know Dave Hill. So how long have you been rollerblading? Uh, I've been rollerblading since 1993. I uh, started roller skating when I was like five though. Yeah, I, I've seen some of your quad clips, so you do yeah. quad as well? Yes, so I'm 40 now, I don't know, yeah, 27 so years of rollerblading. Jesus Christ, man, that's a long time. So you ride for uh, Flying Eagle, is that right? Yes. Yeah. Yes. What's that like? What, what, what is it like being a uh, sponsored skater? It's like a privilege, I guess. Yeah. I feel very blessed. Just life is random like that by chance, but you put work in, yeah. it comes back, I guess. <laughs> yeah, this dude shreds. I can't wait to uh, share his skating with you guys. Um, you know, I met him out on the Northwest Shred Tour in 2019. And you know, you see people on social media and that's one way of uh, capturing their vibe and their skating. But when my wife and I actually met Dave and saw his skating, live that was a totally different experience this guy shreds super <laughs> stoked to have him out here man let's get some food in new additions to the acosta blades youtube channel boom These slick soul sliders, man. The other skates aren't broken in, so I'm gonna switch over to these ones for a bit. Sliders, they matter. I think it's in the next spot. Spot number two is Goose Gossage Skate Park. Um, you know, Briargate was a little too busy and this place seems just about as busy. So we might end up finding our way at some street spots soon. Let's see what we got here at Goose Gossage. 